Hello everyone! With 2024 almost behind us, let's look ahead to what's shaping up to be an exciting year for Linux users. Here are the top 5 Linux distributions you should watch out for in 2025. First up is Pop OS 24.04 LTS. While its beta version debuted in 2024, the stable release is expected early in 2025. This release is particularly exciting because it introduces the cosmic desktop environment, built entirely in Rust. Why should you care? Well, the cosmic desktop brings a sleek and user-friendly experience tailored for productivity. It includes features like improved tiling, customizability, and a refreshed user interface designed to enhance workflow efficiency. Even better, System76 is working on making Cosmic available for other distributions like Fedora, Arch, Serpent OS, and more. This means you'll have the flexibility to enjoy the Cosmic experience on your preferred Linux base. Whether you stick to Pop OS or try Cosmic on a different base, this release is definitely worth your attention. Now, let's talk about KDE Linux and GNOME OS together, since both are taking steps towards creating their official distributions. KDE Linux KDE developers are crafting their own Arch-based distro to deliver the best possible KDE Plasma experience. This distro aims to offer advanced customization, cutting-edge features, and a rock-solid foundation built with Arch's powerful simplicity. Think of it as Endeavor OS, but with direct backing from the KDE team. This gives it an edge in stability, trustworthiness, and seamless integration with KDE technologies, perfect for those who want stability without sacrificing cutting-edge features. GNOME OS Unlike KDE's Arch-based approach, GNOME OS might become an independent operating system. Currently used for testing GNOME desktop features, GNOME OS is evolving into a full-fledged distro. It could redefine how GNOME integrates with Linux by offering an environment finely tuned for its desktop ecosystem. Expect a fresh perspective on user experience, performance, and possibly unique GNOME-centric features. If you're a fan of either desktop environment, these projects are definitely worth keeping an eye on. They promise to bring a new level of polish and innovation to their respective ecosystems. Next is Ubuntu 25.04, set to launch on April 17, 2025. While not an LTS release, it will include exciting updates like GNOME 48 and Linux Kernel 6.14, along with a revamped security center. The revamped security center is expected to make managing system security more intuitive, providing users with detailed insights and easy-to-use controls. GNOME 48 will bring fresh features, performance improvements, and visual enhancements that elevate the overall desktop experience. Combined with Kernel 6.14's advancements, Ubuntu 25.04 will cater to users looking for cutting-edge technology. This version is ideal for users who enjoy experimenting with the latest features and don't mind skipping LTS stability. If you're ready to live on the edge, mark your calendar for this one. Zorn OS continues to impress with its polished and beginner-friendly design. Zorn OS 18, based on Ubuntu 24.04 LTS, is expected to introduce new feature improvements while maintaining its focus on elegance and ease of use. The developers have a track record of delivering innovative features, like the hybrid desktop experience introduced in Zorn OS 17. With Zorn OS 18, we can anticipate even more refined tools for customization better out-of-the-box hardware support, and enhancements to its unique layout switcher that caters to users transitioning from Windows or Mac OS. While we don't have specifics yet, Zorin's history of thoughtful upgrades ensures that this release will be something special for both new and seasoned Linux users. Finally, we have Fedora 42, slated for release on April 22, 2025. This version will feature the highly anticipated Anaconda Web UI installer, which promises a modern and streamlined installation process. The Anaconda Web UI installer is designed to simplify installation for both new and advanced users, offering a cleaner interface and faster setup times. Fedora 42 will also include the latest Linux kernel, GNOME 48, and updates to DNF. These updates aim to improve performance, reliability, and user experience. 
Additionally, Fedora is set to promote a new flagship KDE Plasma Edition, which highlights its commitment to offering diversity in desktop environments. With Fedora's dedication to innovation and frequent updates, this release will be a top choice for tech enthusiasts and developers alike. Of course, there are plenty of other distros to watch in 2025. Vanilla OS, Endeavor OS, and Garuda Linux are just a few that may introduce significant updates in the coming year. Each of these distros brings its own unique flavor and strengths to the Linux ecosystem, ensuring there's something for everyone. What distro are you most excited about? Let me know in the comments below.